Hello and welcome to another video by climbingalbrus.com. Today we've got an awesome job. We've got four really huge mature beech trees that we're doing a little bit of pruning on. Not too much to each tree. So these are the beech trees here. One, two, three, four. Right, that was <laughs> that was like a good 18, 20 feet up that. <clears throat> okay, so now you've just seen me use the flagpole technique on a real life job site out in the real tree climbing world. Um, if you didn't quite understand it or if you weren't able to see from that video um, then I'm going to show you it again now so you can try and understand it more clearly because it if you don't understand the technique it seems like a bit of um, black magic but once you understand the, the, the steps that you have to take to complete the technique it's actually pretty simple and it's a really really useful technique if you climb on moving rope systems all right so i've dropped down this side of the tree done my work over this side i already planned to drop my and dropped my tail down the opposite side of the tree where i'm gonna need to go later and now that time has come so i can use the flagpole technique so now i'm going to first of all lanyard on make sure your lanyard goes around all the ropes so that you don't get caught out once you start pulling it up. Right, weight the lanyard, tension it up if you need. Disconnect your climbing system. Give yourself a bit of slack. Now, you might need a lot of slack or only a little, depending on how far round your rope has to come to get back to you again. Next thing, tie a marlin spike and connect your climbing system then that ensures that your system can't move up or down the rope because you don't want it being pushed by unions or branches and then meaning you, that you can't reach it. Now I'm going to take the leg of line that my termination end is on and I'm going to pull my climbing system all the way up and over the union or branch that I want it. Now. I, I've still got hold of my climbing system, it's like a loop at the moment, so if it gets snagged in a union or something on the way up, I can kind of pull and manipulate it, but that's gone all the way up, no problem. And now I'm going to pull, start pulling the tail of my rope. You just have to be careful there's no stubs or anything that that could get caught on already, you just need to be mindful of that. And now I start pulling my tail down and you can see my climbing system goes through over the branches 
now I'm, I've had to let go of the rest of my climbing system and it's coming down to me, coming down to me disconnect it from the marlin spike, take that nut out connect yourself disconnect your lanyard and hey presto we are off to work